We've been commemorating the International Human Rights Day. Under the theme, Stronger, Better, Stand Up for Human Rights. And we decided today to visit one of the organizations here in Kiriandongo. We are at Refugee Project. These guys have talked about the law, the law. So we want to find out how they feel about today, how human rights, what human rights means to them. So today we are at Refugee Law Project and we shall be moving to other organizations to find out what they think about today, about the human rights under the theme, recover better, stand up for human rights. Okay, Stephen, you're welcome. This is Shakers TV. So how do you feel about today? I feel really excited. You know, um, this is going to be the 72nd commemoration of International Human Rights Day since the UN General Assembly enacting the 1948 Declaration of Universal Human Rights Day. So I'm really excited to commemorate this international day. Yeah, uh, you as the Refugee Law Project, uh, what have you really done to make sure that human rights are actually followed up? We have done quite a lot under the Hawa Access to Justice and program whereby we do legal representation to ensure that people get fair justice. On. Then also we do legal representation in courts, we do mediation, we give legal advices, we do awareness raising sessions on human rights, refugee rights and protection. This is quite a number of activities that we do to ensure that there is um, enjoyment of human rights for every individual, whether being a refugee or a national. Yeah. More so to that, International Human Rights Day in relation to the theme for 2020. Recover, better and stand up for your rights. As a protection legal focal person, we are trying to emphasize, educate, commemorate it as we furthermore encourage our persons of concern not to have their rights violated, but instead to report any violation. It is today that we have seen many voices, many partners, many organizations can stand up for the right of people. And therefore, whoever that has felt that his or her rights have been violated might have been robbed by any means. We ask them that it is today that the day is celebrated and they must be able to contact persons that can push their voices ahead because at times when they come by themselves they will not be able to meet the very person and they will not be able to explain their issue very clear. Therefore when they come through partners and through other individuals that can stand for them, their voices will be heard. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Just go and click on that button. Pam! Then you'll be part of us. Thank you for being part of this event. Thank you so much. God bless you. We'll meet again next time. Don't touch that dial. Make sure you share our channel with everyone you feel like sharing. Thank you so much.